Elon Musk's SpaceX has solidified its reputation as a trailblazer in aerospace, with a track record of pushing the boundaries of innovation. From the groundbreaking Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy to the cutting-edge Dragon spacecraft and the ambitious Starship project, SpaceX continues to redefine what's possible in space exploration. They have astounded us yet again with an exciting development, which is to land Starship on a virtual launch tower at sea. This isn't just any ordinary feat. It's a game-changer that opens up the door to launching Starship from offshore platforms. But believe me, there's so much more to uncover. Join us as we unravel the mysteries behind this captivating concept on today's episode of SpaceX Flight. SpaceX's journey with the Starship program has been a testament to progress and innovation. With each successive launch, we've witnessed remarkable advancements and increasing efficiency. As we gear up for the fourth launch, anticipation is high for yet another leap forward in the Starship program. Following a setback during the third flight with an unexpected atmospheric entry, SpaceX is determined to navigate through this phase and assert control over the descent of Starship. Additionally, the goal to land the Super Heavy booster on a virtual tower in the Gulf of Mexico before preparing for an actual landing attempt at Starbase. Elon Musk has been teasing the idea of a virtual tower, a concept that's crucial for the precision landing of Starship. This innovative approach involves the ship's internal mechanisms controlling its alignment during landing a feat that requires pinpoint accuracy, akin to landing with chopsticks. SpaceX is set to showcase this technology on Starship's upcoming fourth flight, where the vehicle will attempt a sea landing, a crucial step before attempting the real deal on an actual launch tower. This development paves the way for an intriguing possibility, the utilization of offshore launch towers for Starship launches, diverging from traditional land-based launches. SpaceX has long harbored plans for such launches, even acquiring and initiating modifications on two oil rigs named Phobos and Deimos to facilitate Starship launches. However, work on modifying these rigs has been temporarily halted by SpaceX's president, Gwyn Shotwell, as the company focuses on proving the flight reliability of Starship first. Nonetheless, Shotwell has emphasized the increasing importance of offshore launch sites in the future, especially as Starship scales up. As SpaceX ventures into the realm of offshore launch platforms, Questions arise as to what makes them a preferable choice over traditional ones. One compelling reason lies in their capacity to address risks to both humanity and the environment. By launching mighty rockets from the expansive ocean, potential hazards from unexpected incidents are dramatically diminished. The ocean acts as a natural barrier, shielding densely populated areas from potential threats and ensuring the safety of both the launch mission and surrounding communities. But the advantages extend beyond safety alone, as disruption to local communities thanks to intense noise pollution associated with rocket launches are entirely mitigated. The ocean launch platforms offer significant environmental benefits, as launching from the ocean helps mitigate or even eliminate several factors that can harm the environment and ecosystems. Issues like sound disturbances, dust clouds, smoke emissions, and debris, commonly associated with land-based launches, are significantly reduced or absent altogether in ocean-based operations. This translates to a cleaner, less disruptive launch process, preserving the delicate balance of marine ecosystems and minimizing the ecological impact of space exploration endeavors. Sea-based launch platforms aren't just on SpaceX's radar. Other rocket launchers and spaceports are eyeing the ocean for good reason. As Cape Canaveral braces for an influx of launches from a burgeoning number of private companies, its infrastructure will inevitably face strain. As a result, alternative spaceports will soon play a crucial role in the landscape of space exploration. In SpaceX's grand vision, achieving dozens, if not hundreds of launches per day represents a monumental leap forward in rocketry, a feat never before mastered. Their ultimate aim is to democratize spaceflight by reducing costs to levels comparable to air travel. Expanding the launch sites for Starship could skyrocket its launch frequency to unprecedented levels, marking an exciting stride toward realizing this ambitious goal. That's all for today's episode. We really hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. Please share your thoughts with us in the comment box below. We value your input, and it helps us create better videos for you. Also, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss another awesome episode. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.